Good morning. So chanting level one. This is the fourth of five classes. We have one more class next week. So today we will focus primarily on call and response chanting. Get through the chants. We'll just begin with this one uh, invocation. We can say it together. Om Asatoma Sadgamaya Tamasoma Jyotir Gamaya Mrityorma Amrutam Gamaya Om Shanti 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 So today we're going to go through most all the chants and we're going to chant things traditional uh, call and response except for the opening Ashtanga Yoga mantra which we're all familiar with. Uh, the other mantras we will do, we'll repeat twice, uh, call and response, and then we'll re recite it together in unison. So just repeat once for the opening Ashtanga Yoga mantras. Om one day guru nam charanar vinde one day guru nam charanar vinde sandarshita swatma sukhava bodhe sandarshita swatma sukhava bodhe nishreyase jangalikaya mane Nishreya se jangali kaya mane Sansara hala hala moha shantye Sansara hala hala moha shantye <clears throat> Abha kuparusha karam Abha Huparusha Karam Shankha Chakra Siddharinam Shankha Chakra Siddharinam Sahasra Shirasam Shvetam Sahasra Shirasam Shvetam Pranamami Patanjalim Pranamami Patanjalim One second. So, just make sure, a little review, the, the vowels, the short vowels are, of course, they're they're quick and the long vowels are extended so they last twice as long but with the uh, 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 uh make sure you really remember the sensation of the short uh sound uh that it comes from your gut it drops down into your body uh and the long the dirga is comes up into the palate ah uh, 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 uh. So before we go to the next uh, verse, the next mantra, I want, let's recite the vowels one time. I'm going to do the first group. I'll say it twice, and then I'll do the second group. Again, say it twice. Uh, ah, uh, e, e, u, u, r. A A I I U U R A I O A 
I O O And I want you to also remember with the next mantra, dental, the tip of your tongue, whenever the tip of the tongue is being used, comes to the teeth and hold your breath while you're reciting. There's no aspiration in any of the uh, sounds, any of the syllables. Om. Repeat twice. Yogena chit. Tasya padena vacham, yogena chittasya padena vacham, yogena chittasya padena vacham, malam shari ratsya chavaidya kena, malam shari ratsya chavaidya kena. Malam shari rasya chavaidya kena Yo pakarotkam prabaram muninam Yo pakarotkam prabaram muninam Yo pakarotkam prabaram muninam Patanjalim pranjali ranatosmi Patanjalim pranjali ranatosmi Patanjalim pranjali ranatosmi And together Yoge na chittasya padena vacham malam shari rasya chavaidya kena yo pakarotam pravaram muninam patanjalim pranjali ranatosmi And the closing mantra. Om. You can repeat twice. Swasti prajabhya paripala yantam. Swasti prajabhya paripala yantam. Swasti prajabhya paripala yantam. Nyaye na marge na mahi mahi shaha. Nyaye na marge na mahi mahi shaha. Nyaye na marge na mahi mahi shaha. Go brahmane bhyashubhamastunityam. Go Brahmane Bhyashubhamastu Nityam. Go Brahmane Bhyashubhamastu Nityam. Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. Together, Swasti Prajabhya Paripala Yantam. Nyaye Namarge Namahi Mahishaha. Go Brahmane Bhyaha Shubhamastu Nityam. Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. Om Shanti Shanti Shanti. So these are the Pranayama mantras. There's four mantras here. The Pranayama Mantras. Uh, and uh, I think we will repeat this three times instead of twice, one extra time. Om Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam. Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam. Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam 
Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam Shaktincha Tat Putra Parasharancha Shaktincha Tat Putra Parasharancha Shaktincha Tat Putra Parasharancha Shaktincha Tat Putra Parasharancha Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Shri Shankara Charya Matasya Shri Shankara Charya Matasya Shri Shankara Charya Matasya Shri Shankara Charya Matasya Padma Padancha Padma Padancha Padma Padancha Padma Padancha Hasta Malakancha Shishyam Hasta Malakancha Shishyam Hasta Malakancha Shishyam Hasta Malakancha Shishyam Tantro Takam Bartika Kadamukhyan Tantro Takam Vartika Kadamukhyan Tantro Takam Vartika Kadamukhyan Tantro Takam Vartika Kadamukhyan Asmat Gurun Santatamanatosmi Asmat Gurun Santatamanatosmi Asmat Gurun Santatamanatosmi Asmat Gurun Santatamanatosmi Together Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam Shaktin Chatat Putra Parasharancha Vyasam Shukam Gauda Padam Mahantam Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Shri Shankara Charya Matashisham Ya Padma Padancha Hasta Malakancha Shishyam Tantro Takam Bartika Kadamukhyan Asmat Gurun Santatamanatosmi You guys want to do it one more time? Is that enough? Raise your hand if you want to do it one more time. Okay. A couple spots, the Gauda, Gauda retroflex, and down here, Tantro Takam, Gauda, Gauda Padam, Padam. Ah, oh, one more. Narayanam, Narayanam. Om Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam Shaktin Chatat Putra Parasharancha Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam 
गोविंदोगेन्द्रमथाशिष्य श्रीशंकराचार्यमता पद्मकिष्य तंत्रोटकुखियान्मदुरूस्मी So this mantra, all the mantras are important, of course. They all have their own special place and meaning. But uh, this one, particularly the first half of the mantra, is a yoga formula, particularly with pranayama. So this mantra is extra important for us aspiring hatha yoga practitioners. Or Raja Yoga practitioners. Om. Repeat twice. Shanno. Um. When you see the Anuswaras, the M with the dot, the Anuswara. Just listen. It's not always pronounced like an M. Like in this first case, it's going to be pronounced like an N. Shanno Mitra. The second one, because Va comes from your lips, Ma also comes from your lips. So, Shambarunaha. You might have noticed when we did the Shankaracharya, the previous one. Shaktincha. Shaktincha is pronounced like a. A tilde, like in Patanjali, Shaktincha, because cha comes from your palate. So Shaktincha, it's from the same place the cha comes from. So the Anuswaras, the M's with dots over them, always are pronounced from the same place in your mouth that the next letter comes from. No comes from your teeth. Okay, so repeat twice. Shanno Mitra Shambarunaha Om Shanno Mitra Shambarunaha Om Shanno Mitra Shambarunaha Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanna Indro Bruhaspati Shanna Indro Bruhaspati Shanna Indro Bruhaspati Shanno Vishnuru Kramaha Shanno Vishnuru Kramaha Shanno Vishnuru Kramaha Namo Brahmane, Namo Brahmane, Namo Brahmane, Namaste Vayo, Namaste Vayo, Namaste Vayo, Twam Eva Pratyaksham Brahmasi, Twam Eva Pratyaksham Brahmasi, Tuam eva pratyaksham brahmasi. Next one. Tuam eva pratyaksham brahmavadishyami. Tuam eva pratyaksham brahmavadishyami. Tuam eva pratyaksham brahmavadishyami. Ritam Badishyami Ritam Badishyami Ritam Badishyami Satyam Badishyami Satyam Badishyami 
सत्यम वदिष्यामि तन्मामवतु 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 तद्भक्तारमवतु 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 अवतु माम अवतु माम अवतु माम अवतु वक्तारम अवतु वक्तारम अवतु वक्तारम Let's go through one more time just repeat one time Om Shanno Mitra Shambharunaha Om Shanno Mitra Shambharunaha Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanna Indro Bruhaspatihi Shanna Indro Bruhaspatihi Shanno Vishnu Ruru Kramaha Shanno Vishnu Ruru Kramaha Namo Brahmane Namo Brahmane Namaste Vayo Namaste Vayo Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmasi Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmasi Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmavadishyami Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmavadishyami Ritam Vadishyami Ritam Vadishyami Satyam Vadishyami Satyam Vadishyami Tanmam Avatu Tanmam Avatu Tadvaktaram Avatu Tadvaktaram Avatu Avatu Maam Avatu Maam Avatu Vaktaram Avatu Vaktaram Now repeat together one time through. Om Shanno Mitra Shambharunaha Shanno Bhavat Variyama Shanna Indro Bruhaspatihi Shanno Vishnu Ruru Kramaha Namo Brahmane Namaste Vayo Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmasi Tvameva Pratyaksham Brahmavadishyami Ritam Vadishyami Satyam Vadishyami Tanmam Avatu Tadvaktaram Avatu Avatu Maam Avatu Vaktaram Om Shanti 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 Om Sahana Vavatu Om Sahana Vavatu Om Sahana Vavatu Sahana Bunaktu Sahana Bunaktu Sahana Bunaktu Sahaviryam Karavavahai Sahaviryam Karavavahai Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejaspi Navadhi Tamastu Ma Tejaspi Navadhi Tamastu Ma Tejaspi Navadhi Tamastu Ma Vittu
ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಇಲ್ ಡೂ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಪುಟ್ ಬೋತ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ಸ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ತೇಜಸ್ ಪಿನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ಪಿ ನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ಪಿ ನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಓಂ ಸಹನಾವತು ಸಹನಾಪುನಕ್ತು ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕಾರವಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿ ನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿತ್ ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ಪ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ಪ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ಪ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ಒನ್ಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ಪ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ಒನ್ಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ಡು ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ತ್ರೀ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ಅಗೇನ್ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈನ್ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಲೈನ್ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಬಿಗಿನಿಂಗ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿಭ್ಯೋ ಭ್ರಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಕರ್ತೃಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಂ ಷರ್ಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಮಹದ್ಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾಫ್ ಸಾಪ್ಲವಾರಹಿತ 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 ಒನ್ಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ಸಾಪ್ಲವಾರಹಿತ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ದ ದೀಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಟು ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಸಾಪ್ಲವಾರಹಿತ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಸಾಪ್ಲವಾರಹಿತ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಸಾಪ್ಲವಾರಹಿತ ಪ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಘನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾಡ್ಥೋ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈನ್ you want to break it you want to look at it like this brahmai brahmai vahamasmi 
Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat Make sure there's a gap between the Om Tat Sat Om Tat Sat Om Tat Sat Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat So there's a gap before and after Om Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat The second half Sarvo Paplavada Hita Pragnana Gana Pratyagarato Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat The entire uh, mantra Om Namo Brahma Vidbyo Brahma Vidya Sampradaya Kartribyo Namo Vam Sharshibyo Namo Mahadbyo Namo Garubhya Sarvo Paplavarahita Pragnana Gana Pratyagarato Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat Deep inhale, one more time, last one. Om Namo Brahma Vidbyo Brahma Vidya Sampradaya Kartribyo Namo Vam Sharshibyo Namo Mahadbyo Namo Gurubhya Sarvo Pap Lavarahita Pragnana Gana Pratyagarato Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tatsat Alright, so that's the four Pranayama Mantras. Let's do all four of them one time straight through together. Anybody have any any question? Sulochana. Uh, turn your mic on. Uh, I'm, there we go. How do you call Brahma? Brahma or Brahma? The second way you said it, Brahma. Brahma. Like the uh, as if the H, w H as if the H was after the M. Yeah. Brahma. Yeah. Brahma. Okay. It's the the only time I'm aware of where it's pronounced not the way it's written. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. And one of my teachers told me the rule actually why that is. Because the H is always supposed to be soft. Not raspy. And if you Put it before it, be, it will become raspy. Brahma. Brahma. I, yeah. So I was told. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I was told by two different Sanskrit teachers. Uh, okay, so Shankaracharya. So this section, the Pranayama Mantras, uh, it's a little write up on, on them before and then the name of each mantra on each page so Shankaracharya Pratana. It's not really a fancy name. Pratana just means prayer. So
call and response or you want to try re to recite them all together? Recite them all together? One time through? It's okay? Oh, okay. If Sulochana agrees, then definitely we'll do it that way. Okay. Om Narayanam Padma Bhuvam Vasishtam Shaktin Chattat Putra Parasharancha Vyasam Shukam Gaudapadam Mahantam Govinda Yogendra Matashishisham Shri Shankaracharya Matasya Padma Padancha Hasta Marakancha Shisham Tantro Takam Bartika Karamukhyan Asmat Gurun Santatamana Tosmi Om Shanno Mitra Sham Varunaha Shanno Babat Variyama Shanna Indro Pruhas Patihi Shanno Vishnu Rukramaha Namo Brahmane Namaste Vayo Twameva Pratyaksham Brahmasi Twameva Pratyaksham Brahma Vadishyami Ritam Vadishyami Satyam Vadishyami Tanmamavatu Tadbhaktaram avatu avatu maam avatu vaktaram Om Shanti 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 Om Sahana Bhavatu Sahana Bhunaktu Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejasvinavati Tamastu Mavit Vishavahai Om Shanti 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 Om Namo Brahma Vidyo Brahma Vidya Sambradaya Kartribyo Namo Vam Sharishibyo Namo Mahadyo Namo Guru Bhyaha Sarvo Paplavada Hita Pragnana Ghana Pratigarito Brahmai Vahamasmi Om Tat Sat Om Vakratunda Mahakaya Koti Surya Samaprabha Avignam Kuru Medeva Sarva Koryeshu Sarvada Om Sahana Bhavatu Sahana Bhunaktu Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejaspinavadi Tamastu Mavit Vishavahai Om Shanti 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 Om Asatoma Sadgamaya Tamasoma Jyotir Gamaya Mrit 
your ma amrutanga maya om shanti 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 hi <clears throat> so the breathing should be coordinated with the mantras. I hope you guys are remembering that. The end of each line is where you want to breathe in before the next line. Um, a lot of the lines you can get away with not really concentrating on, on breathing in. But some of the lines, if they're long, like uh, this one in, in Sahana Bhavatu, the, this line, the last line. If you don't breathe in, you're not going to make it all the way through. <laughs> and the last, the Pranayama Mantras, both those verses are long. Both the two first and the second lines are long, so you have to remember to, to breathe in. And then you'll get much more of the Pranayama benefit from the Mantras. So, rather than going into the meaning of that one Shanti Mantra, I want to go over the five Mangala Mantra verses. Uh, call and response. So everybody is comfortable with the closing mantra. So we'll just say this together. And then the, the next four verses we'll recite call and response. Breathe in before each recitation, each phrase. Om Swasti Prajabhyahav Paripalayantam Nyayena Margena Mahi Mahishaha Go Brahmanebhyaha Shubhamastu Nityam Loka samasta sukhino bhavantu Kale varshatu parajanyaha Kale varshatu parajanyaha Prativi satsya shalani Prativi satsya shalani Desho yang shobarhitaha Desho yang sho barhitaha Brahmana santu nirbhyaha Brahmana santu nirbhyaha Together Kale varshatu prajanyaha Prativi satsya shalani Desho yang sho bharitaha Brahmana santu nirbhyaha <coughs> Aputra putrina santu Putrina santu pautrinaha Aputra putrina santu Putrina santu Pautrinaha Aputra Putrina Santu Putrina Santu Pautrinaha Adana Sadana Santu Adana Sadana Santu Jeevantu Shadadam Shatam Jeevantu Shadadam Shatam Aputra putrina santu putrina santu pautrinaha adana sadana santu jivantu sharadam shatam <coughs> sarvesham swastir bhavatu Sarvesham swastir bhavatu Sarvesham shantir bhavatu 
ಶಾಂತಿರ್ಭವತು ಪೂರ್ಣ ಪೂರ್ಣ ಮಂಗಲ ಮಂಗಲ ಸೊ ಯು ಸಿ ದ ತ್ರೀ ಟೂ ದ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಆನ್ ಈಚ್ ಲೈನ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಸಾಡ್ವೇಷಾಂತು right so you just have to get the middle word once you get the sarvesham swastir bhavatu sarvesham shantir bhavatu sarvesham purnam bhavatu sarvesham mangalam bhavatu sarvesham swastir bhavatu ಶಾಂತಿರ್ಭವತು ಪೂರ್ಣ ಮಂಗಲ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ಯು ನೋ ದಟ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಜಾಭ್ಯ ಪರಿಪಾಲಿಯಂತ ರೈಟ್ ಯು ಆರ್ಡಿ ನೋ ದಟ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ಶಾಂತಿ ಯು ನೋ Om Shanti 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 Hi and Mangala, you know, Mangala Mantra, right? So, I think this verse, fairly easy, you can memorize this. So, if you don't already know this verse, uh, in addition to practicing to be able to recite the other verses this week, see... put it as a goal to be able to memorize this verse purnam purnam so one word and if you know that one shanti mantra purnam adav purnam idam purnat purnam then also you know this word already too so om sarvesham swastir bhavatu sarvesham shantir bhavatu sarvesham purnam bhavatu sarvesham mangalam bhavatu but this is my favorite one this is my all time favorite one <clears throat> this summarizes yoga as uh, one of the definitions of yoga is the disconnection from suffering and why this is from the bhagavad gita krishna teaches us three definitions of yoga and the third definition i think it's um 623 chapter 6 verse 23 is the disconnection from y- from suffering why he says disconnection uh rather than the ending he doesn't just say the ending of suffering or he says the disconnection from suffering because if you watch your mind carefully and honestly you'll see there's we have so much attachment to these ideas you know we choose suffering over happiness all the time when we're getting upset about things or letting things bother us or etc 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 there's always an attachment that we're more attached to our i our notions and our ideas about things being a certain way we choose that over the choice to be happy the ability to just turn our mind away from it and just be happy <laughs> so it, the disconnection from suffering is the third definition uh and this is basically what this mantra the second half is telling us right, to be able to see goodness in everything right so that we don't suffer because nobody wants suffering and right, to see the the auspiciousness bhadra the bhadra auspiciousness in everything and there's one other there's another shanti mantra which we'll do next week ಭದ್ರಂ ಕಡನೆ ಬಿಷ್ಣುಯಾಮ ದೇವಾ ಭದ್ರಂ ಪಶ್ಯೇಮ ಅಕ್ಷಭಿರ್ಯಜತ್ರ ಸೋ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಸೀ ದ ಆಸ್ಪಿಷಿಯಸ್ನ
in everything. Yajatraha means that which is worthy of worship. So the Bhadra, right, the eternal essence, the, the pure na essence, that's the inner nature of everything, to see that. Uh, then, uh, of course, you'll have a much healthier outlook and a much healthier or a much more positive and pleasant experience if that's where your perspective is focused. This last line says, who would want suffering? Nobody wants suffering. That's what the last line says. Om Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Once more Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Say together the entire uh, verse together two times. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Nidamayaha Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kaschit Dukkha Bhag Bhavet Om Shanti 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 Denise? Um, I have two questions. Ah. One is, um, one of the, the hard one. Um, oh, okay, so in the Mangala Mantra, they show, they show young, show, I, I, I'm not able to say it. Okay, yeah. I better put it back up. Oops. Shoba. Shoba. Curl your tongue back. Sh, like uh, Yeah. Like an X. Shoba. Rahitaha. Huh? Shoba. Rahitaha. Shoba. Rahitaha. Rahita. Rahita. Okay. Rahita. Shoba Rahita. Shoba Rahita. Okay. De Shoyam. De Shoyang. Shoba Rahita. De Shoyang. Shoba Rahita. Shoba Rahita. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> One more. Uh huh. Um, so I'm looking at Mangala meaning, which is like the auspicious ceremony Mangalia you wrote in the back. Okay, yeah. Is it the same thing, Mangalia and Mangala? 
Mangala is basically more of an adjective, meaning auspicious or ceremonious or festive. So anything that has the qualities of Mangala can be called as a Mangalia. The two words are similar but different. Mangalia is the noun, Mangala is the adjective. And so what it's so so Shanti mantras is like the peace mantras. Shanti and mantras, Mangala? yeah. Shanti mantras are Vedic mantras. Okay, they're, what they're all Mangala? they're they come from the Upanishads. Okay. And the Mangala mantras are Puranic. The Puranas are are the epics, the stories, like the Ramayana and the Mahabharata, the Bhagavad Gita from the Bhagavad Gita comes from the Mahabharata. It's a section, yeah. yeah, in the Mahabharata. Those are called Puranas. There's the Shiva Purana, the Vishnu Purana, so many different Puranas. 21 oh. Puranas, actually. And. Okay. Yeah, they're non. They're, they're composed in verse. Verse meaning like. The yeah. lines have the same number of syllables, or there's a repetitive pattern from verse to verse. In the Vedic mantras, you won't find a repetitive pattern from line to line. Huh. Yeah, it's 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 like classical music, you know, very little repetition. Yeah, the non-Vedic mantras have a repetitive pattern to the rhythm, like folk music or pop music has a repetitive pattern to the rhythm and the melody. Vedic mantra is classical. <laughs> no, re very little repetitive patterns to the melody and the rhythm. The Mangala mantras come from the uh, Srimad Bhagavat Purana, a fairly popular s stories of Krishna. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Yeah. Have a beautiful day. Om Tat Sat Brahmar Panamastu.